welcome back to TDA Lifestyle. Welcome. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and do so. Thank you subscribe. so much for tuning in. Thank you guys. So, in today's video, we will be showing you how to make coconut milk. Very, very simple. This is a plant-based milk, which is a full of protein. And this is where we get our protein from. So for those of you who don't know, we do not eat any animal products. We do not eat any processed food. So we usually make our own stuff, our own milk, because we want it fresh. We do not buy any canned food, or all those mm -hmm. kind of things. So we eat like 100% healthy, plant-based, mm -hmm. natural. Mm -hmm. So yeah. So yes, guys, and also we mind uh, the salt that we take. We don't take the white salt. We take Himalayan uh, pink salt, and we we also use um, canola oil, uh, be well, and uh, or coconut oil. So basically this is what we use in our day-to-day -day, um, cooking and eating. So yeah, stay tuned. We will be showing you other recipes as time mm -hmm. goes by. But for today, we'll show you the basics of how to make coconut milk with the Yay! fresh coconut, guys. Coconut, guys. Fresh coconut. fresh coconut, okay. So this is what we do. And uh, stay tuned and stay watch. Tuned. Very simple. And hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget to like, yeah, share, share, and subscribe. subscribe. It's like there's a mouth and there are two eyes and these are the holes that are very soft and that will help you to just poke a knife in and um, get it open so you can empty the water. Watch. Listen to it. It actually sounds like as if you're opening a can of something. I hope you can hear it. Maybe that was a little bit just a bit quiet but it actually sounds like you're opening a can or something amazing guys and then here you've got one hole so I'm just gonna open this one hole just make sure that it's nice and opened and uh, voila you have a hole can you see and then you pour the water out. This is what I do. Pour the water out. Pour the water out. Sounds good, doesn't it? Yeah, look at that. So much water coming out of this um, normal size um, coconut. Isn't God good? Okay, so what do we do with this water? We drink it, guys. Mm. 
very sweet. Now, I'm gonna open the coconut. So, what I do before I open the coconut, I tap it a little uh, with a hammer just to try and get the meat as loose as I possibly can. Just tap, tap. Uh, I managed to crack it open. In order to smash coconut open, throw it on a concrete floor or a wall or throw it at someone's head. <laughs> Not threw it on the floor and then uh, it's open now that it's mm, this is nice and fresh. So, what I need to do are you gonna use your butter knife? Knife to remove the meat, you just have to be very careful because the Shell is a little bit dangerous. I can't touch you. I've cut myself so many times. But for the love of coconut, keep going. And yeah, when you use your butter knife, it's kind of just make sure that you're separating the meat from the shell. Basically what I've done is after I've removed the coconut uh, flesh uh, meat from the, the, the shell, this is what I have. It, it looks like this, okay? You've got this brown skin, uh, brown skin there. And what we need to do, you don't want to blend it like this, otherwise you're not going to get the white color for milk. You see, it's going to become brownish. So, what we did is... I Removed um, the brown cover, the brown skin, removed it to make it look like this. Okay, so now we're gonna cut them in pieces so that we can blend it. Okay, just cut them in pieces. You can easily just small tiny pieces like this. And then now I'm gonna use our blender. Now this is uh, the cloth, a uh, very a clean cloth that we're going to use um, to filter the milk um, from the blender once it has blended for under two minutes. And um, so I'm just going to take it out, open it, and then you have something like this. See, there's the milk, guys. See the milk? Okay. And then I'm going to just filter it so that all the liquid stays in the jar and then we will have flakes coconut flakes which we don't need we just want the milk just pour it out The, the 
milk drain down into the jug. And then what we're going to do, we're going to milk the cow in a way. Okay, we're going to squeeze it out, squeeze out all the milk, squeeze as much as you can. Squeeze as much as you can. Uh, everything has been squeezed and we are left with like with flakes, coconut flakes, which we don't need. Let's go ahead. This coconut milk can stay in the refrigerator for a maximum of three days. Leave it outside the refrigerator for an hour before use and shake well before consuming. Enjoy guys! Um, yeah, basically this is how you make coconut milk. Come on! Okay guys, so here is the coconut water that we saved and that we took out earlier on and we are about to drink it. Hello something! Thanks guys. Bye. God bless you. See you on our next video.